let us pray. Father, you send us into this world to bring healing and the good news of your kingdom. We pray for areas where suffering and pain are the everyday experience of so many. For places crippled by poverty, inequality and injustice. We ask you to bless all who seek to bring those suffering to the good news of your love at Caring for Life. Who are our mission partners in Leeds who care for at-risk people. Some of whom have known the most horrendous abuse and neglect. We join with those at Caring for Life in thanking you for every beneficiary they are privileged to care for. Thank you for the ability for people to return to the farm in April, for the one-to-one -one walks that have happened and the safe reopening of outside projects. We pray for those supported, whose minds and bodies have been broken by the traumas they have endured. We pray that they will come to know Jesus as Saviour, that they will know the one who would be their friend, that they will seek forgiveness for their sins and be given grace to cope with the hurt caused by the sins of others. We also pray for those supported who are trapped and suffering within dangerous relationships. We pray that Caring for Life will be able to help them break away and that the void will be filled with the love of Jesus. Father, you send us into the world together to learn to work together and enjoy partnership in the gospel. We pray for the church, that a spirit of cooperation and mutual support will continue to triumph over barriers of suspicion and arguments. We ask you to give confidence to all Christians who proclaim the good news of your grace. We pray for St Luke's and St Andrew's parish churches to have a hunger for studying the gospel, so that we can guide and guard one another in it. And we pray that our dedication to God's word would build a culture of sharing it with others to make your name known. Father, you send us out in your name, not promising that the path will be easy, with the assurance that your grace will be sufficient for all our needs. Thank you that we know you are always with us. We take a moment now to name to ourselves those we know who are struggling in any way and ask for them to know your comfort and peace. We ask that they may be reassured by the good news of Jesus' risen presence. We pray all these things in the names of our Saviour, Jesus Christ. Amen. <laughs>